Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's Dr. Alessandro. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about something called Eagle Syndrome. Now, this is a viewer-based question because a viewer did bring up uh, the topic of Eagle Syndrome, and we actually had a case not too long ago in our practice, uh, which was definitively diagnosed as Eagle Syndrome. So, what is Eagle Syndrome? Well, no, it's not being a fan of a team from Philadelphia nor is it being a fan of a great rock band. But what it is, it's called also stylohyoid syndrome or carotid artery syndrome. And it is actually commonly affecting adults. I guess every now and again, a young person can have this too. But what it is, is it's the elongation of the styloid process of the inferior aspect of the temporal bone in your head. Um, it can also be the mineralization of the stylohyoid ligament. Now, it can also even be both if it is more extreme. In many cases, it's not symptomatic. That is, most people may have it and not even know that they have it. But in some cases, in some cases, it is symptomatic. So what can happen in the folks uh, that happen to be feeling the effects of this syndrome or exhibiting uh, symptoms of this syndrome? Well, um, the symptoms can vary among people, but they can be you know, pain, uh, discomfort when turning the head, uh, all the way up to even periodic fainting episodes. So they, there can be a bunch of different type of symptoms. Um, now, why would they have these symptoms? Well, with the elongation of the styloid process or the mineralization of the stylohyoid ligament, the nearby blood vessels and nerves kind of get pinched or impinged upon or pushed, maybe even compressed. And so that would cause the symptoms of pain, uh, and discomfort if you're turning your head because the ligament's kind of in that position. Or, you know, even if they're impinging blood vessels and the movement of blood, that can cause the fainting. So, so yeah, those are the reasons why the symptoms can be what they are with Eagle Syndrome. Now, what can you do? Well, um, you know, treatment is usually reassurance if it's a mild case. You don't really have to do much. You can take corticosteroids, and that might help with the inflammation part. Um, you know, and so that could be a good thing. In really more serious cases, surgery is indicated to either kind of reduce the elongated styloid process or to remove the mineralized ligament. Uh, but uh, it is really the last resort. Uh, so. Those are the basics of Eagle Syndrome. There are a couple of other things. I mean, you can get vague facial pain with Eagle Syndrome. Um, you can other, otherwise also get trouble speaking, trouble swallowing. So there are a couple of other small things involved with Eagle Syndrome, but those are kind of more minor. Um, you could say they're more minor details, uh, but they can happen. So in any event, that is what Eagle Syndrome is. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for joining me and hope you're all staying well and healthy.